Hey, Brian from Steak Bites here. People ask me all the time, why should I watch Snake Bites? So I figured I'd put together a top 10 list of the best reasons why anyone should check out the show. You're watching Snake Bites. Now the number 10 reason why you should watch Snake Bites are all the cool snakes we show, starting with these ball pythons. Number nine, with my 25 years of experience and encyclopedia type knowledge of reptiles, no question goes unanswered, me. You guys know that I haven't been that great in the past on breeding boas, but I've been doing a ton of research on these guys. They're really incredible animals. They're live bears. Um, they're actually from, um, hey Cal, where the hell are boas from? These Argentine rainbow boas are really cool. It's something you don't see very often. You see a lot of Colombians and Brazilians, but Argentines are kind of unique because they stay smaller. They're of the same genus, but different species. These guys are an Epicrates, um, Epicrates. Hey, Kel, do you remember what species these guys are? A lot of people ask me how to sex corn snakes. It's actually really easy because the male snakes actually have a longer base of the tail, but the surefire way to absolutely make sure is to just go ahead and invert these guys out. Hey, Kel, can you show these guys how to sex this snake? Ow! Number eight, the fun-loving guys on my crew. It's 2.30! Guys, back to work. Number seven, and my personal favorite, baby snakes hatching. Coming in at number six, our genius in residence, Dr. Chewy. While watching any TV show, there will always be intellectual benefits. Shows on the Discovery Channel, like Man vs. Wild and such as Survivor Man and the Van Man, Man vs. Wild. <laughs> shows on Discovery such as Survivor Man, the man versus the wild. These can be helpful to you if you're ever in dangerous situations. Additionally, some networks, arguably, and I mean arguably, provide viewers with intellectually intelligent, mind-blowing material. <laughs> viewers with intellectually challenged material for the mind. That's good. Take, for example, the modern anthropological series I like to call Jersey Shore. This fascinating program studies the intellectual homo sapien douchebag homosexual douchebagius. <laughs> this program studies the mating rituals of the homo sapien douchebagginess. One of my personal favorites, Judge Judy, studies the examples of the legal P 
penile system on that informational superhighway running through your mind. A program like Channel Frederators are breaking down all barriers between creators and audiences in a way that will change the system that we receive entertainment for years to come. I like cartoons. What about snake bites? Snake bites? Never heard of it. Keep watching, and I mean keep watching, internet video in one day. Well, maybe not, but you could try to be as smart as the great Dr. Chu. Number five, feeding snakes. And number four, hot babes. Number three, rare cutting edge snakes like this pinstripe super stripe. Number two, and always a fan favorite, Chewy getting bit. Ah, quit biting me! Ah, 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 Okay, the wait is over. The number one reason why you guys need to watch Snake Bites. It's cat videos on YouTube are way overrated. After all, I love all animals, guys. You guys know that. But gosh, I'm so sick of those LOL cats. And what's with this mean kitty? Come on, snakes are the cool thing. They're here. They're now. You got to watch Snake Bites. Spread the word. For this week's Comment of the Week on the Old Time Snakes episode, the question was, in what time period would you want to live? And Caterpillar Giraffe said, I'd love to live back in the 60s. Some people argue living back then, especially women. But if you're a hippie, everyone is treated equally. I love the culture, the peace, and the music back then. Everything about it makes me jealous I wasn't born until the 90s. Yeah, I totally agree. The 60s were a great time for music, and I've got to imagine it would have been an awesome time to live for the most part. Until next time, you guys keep sending me creative comments. I'm going to feature you on a future episode. All right, guys, it's Cal's Question of the Week. Now, you heard our top 10 reasons for watching Snake Fights. I want to know from you guys, what's your number one reason for watching the show? Text or video comment below. Let us know. So there it is, the top 10 reasons why we think you guys should keep watching the show. We love producing this show, but we're always looking for more people to watch. And if you guys like it, make sure to embed this on your Facebooks, MySpaces, put it up on message boards, send it around your email list, help us spread the word about our show. And speaking about spreading the word, you may notice that our friends over at USARC sent us some gear that we're sporting this week. We want to just thank them for all that they're doing for the reptile community and all the organizations that are helping us keep our rights to keep these wonderful animals. Until next week, you've been watching Snake Bites.